Once upon a time, there was a righteous king named Harish Chandra, who was known for his truthfulness and justice. But beneath the veneer of virtue, there lay a dormant volcano of anger, waiting for the right moment to erupt and wreak havoc. King Harish Chandra was the epitome of integrity, yet he was not immune to the gnawing bite of anger. It was this burning rage that led him to the fateful day when, in a fit of fury, he gambled away his kingdom, his wife, and his beloved son. The roll of the dice, fueled by uncontrolled anger, changed the course of his life forever. This tale from the annals of Hindu mythology isn't just a story. It's a stark reminder of the catastrophic consequences of uncontrolled anger. King Harish Chandra, who was once revered for his righteousness, found himself stripped of his dignity, his family, and his kingdom. His anger didn't just cost him material possessions, it cost him the love and respect of his subjects, his wife and his son. But the story doesn't end there. King Harishchandra's tale is also one of redemption. He recognized the error of his ways and sought to make amends, to regain what he had lost not through anger, but through patience, understanding and forgiveness. It was a bitter pill to swallow, but it was a necessary journey towards self-realization and growth. In every career, in every life, there are moments of anger. Moments when the dice rolls in a way we did not anticipate. But we must remember the tale of King Harish Chandra and understand that anger, when unchecked, can lead to catastrophic consequences. It can make us gamble away our careers, our relationships and our self-respect. And so King Harish Chandra's anger cost him everything dear to him. His story is a cautionary tale a lesson for us all to manage our anger before it manages us. Because when we let anger guide our actions, we risk losing much more than we could ever imagine. Just like King Harish Chandra, our unchecked anger can lead to disastrous results in our lives and careers. Anger, a common human emotion, can become a destructive force when not managed properly. While it's natural to feel anger from time to time, when this emotion is not properly addressed, it can have serious implications, especially in our professional lives. Let's delve into some research findings that shed light on the negative impact of anger on our professional life. According to a study published in the Journal of Organisational Behaviour in 2020, anger at the workplace can lead to decreased productivity. This is because anger can cloud our judgement, leading to impulsive decisions and hindering our ability to think clearly and logically. Another study, published in the Journal of Applied Psychology in 2021, revealed that anger can lead to strained professional relationships. When anger is not properly managed, it can lead to conflicts and misunderstandings, creating a hostile work environment that is not conducive to collaboration and teamwork. Furthermore, a study conducted by the American Psychological Association in 2023 found that unchecked anger can even lead to job loss. Employees who frequently exhibit anger are perceived as unprofessional and are often passed over for promotions or even terminated. Additionally, unchecked anger can lead to long-term health issues. According to a study published in the Journal of the American Heart Association in 2022, chronic anger can increase the risk of heart disease, one of the leading causes of death worldwide. In essence, unchecked anger can lead to lost opportunities, strained relationships and even job loss. It's crucial to acknowledge and address this emotion, to ensure that it doesn't hinder our professional growth and overall well-being. But remember, it's not about suppressing this emotion, it's about understanding its root cause, managing it effectively, and channeling it into a more productive energy. After all, as Dr. Joga aptly puts it in her book, you are the light, anger is not the enemy. It's a signal that something needs to change. Unchecked anger can lead to lost opportunities, strained relationships, and even job loss. But where does this anger come from? In the bustling arenas of our workplaces, anger often takes root in the fertile soil of stress and pressure. The relentless demand for results, the ticking clock, the looming deadlines, all act as potent catalysts that can ignite the flame of anger. And let's not forget the human element. Interpersonal conflicts, disagreements, and misunderstandings they all add fuel to the fire. When we feel unheard, undervalued or disrespected, it's all too easy for our emotions to take a heated turn. But the seeds of anger do not exclusively sprout from external sources. They can also stem from within us, from our own thoughts, perceptions and expectations. 
a study conducted by the American Psychological Association in 2022, revealed that our own interpretations of situations, our sense of entitlement, or our inability to accept certain realities can also give birth to anger. It's important to remember that anger is not inherently bad. It's a natural human response, a survival instinct even. It can serve as a protective shield when we feel threatened or wronged. But when it's unchecked, uncontrolled, it can transform into a destructive force, causing havoc in our professional lives. In the words of Dr. Joga, from her enlightening book, You Are the Light, Seven Powerful Ways to Illuminate the Darkness Within, anger, when harnessed, can illuminate the path to assertiveness and fairness. But when left to run wild, it can darken the path with resentment and hostility. So how do we prevent this from happening? We start by identifying the source, the root cause of our anger. We dig deep, peel back the layers and confront the core of our discontent. It's not always a comfortable journey, but it's a necessary one. By understanding what triggers our anger, we can begin to control it. We can start to change our responses, our reactions. We can choose calm over chaos, peace over pandemonium. Understanding the root cause of our anger is the first step to addressing it. Now, let's delve into some effective strategies to manage anger. As we traverse this journey, we'll explore the realms of mindfulness, breathing exercises and positive affirmations as tools in your anger management arsenal. Famed philosopher and poet Rumi once said, the cure for pain is in the pain. This rings true when dealing with anger. Instead of avoiding it, we must face it. Mindfulness is the first step in this process. It's the practice of being fully present and engaged in the moment, aware of your thoughts and feelings without distraction or judgment. When anger arises, mindfulness allows us to observe it as an outsider without being consumed by it. A study published in the Journal of Clinical Psychology in 2021 found that mindfulness-based interventions significantly reduced anger in participants. Next, let's talk about breathing exercises. When we're angry, our bodies enter a state of high arousal, heart rate and blood pressure increase, and stress hormones flood our system. Breathing exercises can help calm this physiological storm. The American Institute of Stress recommends a technique known as the 478 breathing. You inhale for a count of four, hold your breath for seven, and exhale for eight. This slows the heart rate and helps to lower the blood pressure, bringing your body back to a calmer state. Now, on to positive affirmations. These are statements that help to challenge and overcome negative thoughts. When you're feeling angry, affirmations can help to redirect your focus towards positive emotions and outcomes. For example, instead of saying to yourself, I'm so angry I can't control it, try saying, I am in control of my emotions and I choose peace over anger. A study in the Journal of Positive Psychology in 2022 showed that positive affirmations can effectively reduce anger and improve emotional well-being. As we explore these strategies, remember the sage words of Aristotle, anyone can become angry, that is easy, but to be angry with the right person, to the right degree, at the right time, for the right purpose, and in the right way, that is not easy. These strategies are not about suppressing your anger, they're about understanding it, acknowledging it, and then using it as fuel for positive action. When channeled correctly, anger can be a powerful motivator, driving us to seek justice, to stand up for ourselves, and to make positive changes in our lives and in the world around us. Remember, the key to managing anger is not suppression, but understanding and channeling it constructively. By practicing mindfulness, engaging in breathing exercises, and harnessing the power of positive affirmations, you're not just managing your anger, you're transforming it into a force for good. And that, my friends, is the true power of anger management. What happens if we choose to ignore our anger? This question sets the stage for an exploration into the repercussions of unaddressed anger, especially in the context of our professional lives. Anger, when left unchecked, can act like a slow poison, gradually seeping into the fabric of our work environment. It can lead to decreased productivity. The constant inner turmoil and the energy spent on suppressing anger can significantly drain our mental resources, leaving little room for focus and creativity. A study in the Journal of Occupational and Environmental Medicine in 2021 found that employees who reported high levels of anger had a 25% decrease in productivity. 
This not only affects the individual, but also the overall performance of the team and the organization. Increased conflict is another consequence of unaddressed anger. It's like a spark that can ignite a wildfire of disputes and disagreements. This not only disrupts the harmony in the workplace, but also strains professional relationships. A report published by the Harvard Business Review in 2022 highlighted that unresolved anger was a leading cause of team conflicts and breakdowns in communication. The most severe consequence of unaddressed anger, however, could be potential job loss. It's not uncommon for organizations to part ways with employees who consistently exhibit anger issues as it jeopardizes the work environment's safety and tranquility. In a 2023 survey by the American Management Association, it was found that over a third of employees who were fired had a history of unresolved anger issues. Ignoring our anger doesn't make it disappear. Instead, it builds up over time, increasing its destructive potential. It's like a ticking time bomb waiting to explode. We must remember that anger, like any other emotion, is a part of us. It is not something to be feared or shunned, but understood, acknowledged and managed. Ignoring our anger doesn't make it disappear. It only amplifies its destructive potential. Dr. Joga, in her book, You Are the Light, Seven Powerful Ways to Illuminate the Darkness Within, emphasizes the importance of addressing anger. She paints a vivid picture of anger as a dark shadow, clouding our judgment, blurring our vision, and ultimately impeding our progress. In her insightful narrative, she outlines seven key strategies to manage anger effectively. The first step, she insists, is acknowledging its presence. Many of us, ensnared in denial, fail to recognize the signs of simmering fury until it boils over into an eruption. But in acknowledging our anger, we have taken the first crucial step towards managing it. Next, she urges us to identify the triggers. Every flash of anger has a root cause, a trigger. Is it a critical remark from a colleague, a missed deadline, or perhaps a perceived slight from a superior? Once we know what sparks our anger, we can begin to diffuse it. Thirdly, she advocates for the practice of mindfulness. By staying present and conscious of our reactions, we can choose to respond rather than react to anger-inducing situations. The fourth strategy revolves around communication. Dr. Yoga emphasizes the importance of expressing our frustrations and disappointments constructively, turning potential conflicts into opportunities for growth. Fifth, she encourages us to seek support. Whether it's through a trusted friend, a mentor, or a professional counselor, having a sounding board can be a powerful tool in managing anger. The sixth strategy is about self-care. Regular exercise, adequate sleep, and a balanced diet can play a significant role in our emotional well-being. Finally, she encourages us to practice forgiveness. Holding on to grudges only fuels the fire of anger. By choosing to forgive, we choose to free ourselves from the shackles of resentment. Addressing our anger is not just about maintaining harmony in our workplace, it's about personal growth and self-empowerment. As we learn to navigate the turbulent seas of our emotions, we become the beacon, illuminating the darkness within. And in that light, we find our true potential. At M Yoga Coaching and Consulting, we understand the challenge of managing anger. We've crafted specialized programs, drawing from Dr. Joga's profound insights and seminal work to help you identify and address the root causes of your anger. Our sessions delve deep into understanding your unique triggers, providing you with tailored strategies to manage and channel your anger constructively. We offer one-on-one -on -one coaching, group coaching, and online courses all aimed at equipping you with the tools to transform your anger into a catalyst for positive change. But we don't stop there. Our post-coaching support ensures that you continue to apply these strategies effectively long after our sessions end. Remember, anger is a powerful emotion, but it doesn't have to dictate your professional life. We are here to help you navigate the stormy seas of your emotions and guide you towards a more peaceful, productive professional life. Are you ready to take the first step towards managing your anger and transforming your career? We believe in you and your ability to channel your emotions effectively to not only improve your work life, but also to elevate your personal life. Adam Yoga Coaching and Consulting, we're committed to helping you identify the causes and triggers of your anger. We offer you the tools to deal with this powerful emotion in the most productive way ensuring it doesn't negatively impact your career. 
we're proud to extend an invitation to you for a complimentary career breakthrough call. This isn't just a conversation. It's an opportunity for you to start a journey towards self-discovery and growth. It's a chance for you to understand your anger, to control it and to harness it for your success. Don't let anger steer your career off course. Let's work together to navigate towards success. Before we conclude, let's quickly recap what we've covered today. We've journeyed through the wrath of King Harishchandra, highlighting the profound effect of anger on our lives. It can cloud our judgment, strain relationships and significantly derail our career trajectories. We've delved into the root causes of anger, reminding us that it's often a symptom of underlying issues. Unresolved conflicts, unmet expectations and feelings of powerlessness can all brew into a tempest of rage if not properly addressed. We've also explored strategic anger management techniques. These aren't just about suppressing anger, but rather understanding and acknowledging it, then channeling it productively. Remember, anger in itself isn't bad. It's a normal human emotion, but it becomes detrimental when it's not expressed appropriately or when it gains the upper hand. We've also painted a vivid picture of the consequences of unaddressed anger. It's not just a personal issue. It can permeate your professional life, impacting your reputation, productivity and opportunities for advancement. Then we shone a light on Dr. Joga's enlightening work. You are the light seven powerful ways to illuminate the darkness within. This book, the second in her self-empowerment series, offers valuable insights and practical strategies to manage anger effectively. We at M. Joga Coaching and Consulting are committed to helping you navigate this journey. Our aim is to help you identify the causes and triggers of your anger and equip you with the tools to deal with this powerful emotion in a way that augments, not impedes, your career. As we wrap up, remember that you're not alone in this. We're here, ready and willing, to walk with you. We invite you to book a complimentary career breakthrough call with us. Let's work together to turn your anger into a catalyst for growth and success. In the words of Mahatma Gandhi, anger is the enemy of non-violence and pride. It is costly at all levels. Even the intention to harm another is to harm yourself.